Hey, how's it going? I hope things are going really well for you and you're being very productive and focused in the midst of this whole coronavirus situation that we find ourselves in. And I just want to share a couple of ideas that are coming up in my own experience. Maybe they'll be beneficial to you on your journey. There's a lot of the energy in the world right now is all over the place. There's, there's no question, right? And it can be very distracting as creators when we want to stay focused on the things that want to come through us. Because in a very real sense, there's always something that's going to distract us. There's always something that's going to pull or trying to pull our energy and focus away from doing the work that we came here to do in the world every single day, right? Especially if you listen to the news and the media, their whole goal is to get you to watch their programming and to have you pay attention. And, and our work as creative human beings is to stay focused on what wants to come through us and to stay focused on the work that we came here to do. You came here to do certain things. You have certain things you want to build in your business. You have things that you want to create, right? You want to do better things in your business. You have strategies and ideas you want to implement. You have things that you want to create in your life, in your personal life. And the honest truth is, whatever's happening out in the real world, there's always going to be something happening. There's always going to be something happening. But our work is to stay tuned in to our inner world and really focused on who we want to be, what we want to do, and what we want to have. That's our main focus. I was just spending some time this morning writing down my goals and dreams for my business and my life and getting them concrete, getting re a lot of clarity around that, which is a morning journaling practice that I do very frequently. And this helps me focus because there's so much going on out in the real world. One of the things that I think about a lot, and especially these last few weeks, is the story of the monk that's being chased by tigers, right? Tigers are chasing him. He's running, running, running. He comes to a cliff with some vines hanging off the edge of the cliff and he and he climbs down the vines a little ways down the cliff so that the tigers cannot get to him. They're still up there, right? Ferociously wanting to attack him. Hanging onto this vine over the cliff, looks down, sees alligators in the ravine of the of the area beneath him, right? Chomping at the bit to take a bite out of him. Looks to his right and there is a little mouse chewing on that vine, eating away at that vine, gnawing that vine, and it's only a period of time before he's gonna fall down into those alligators, or if he climbs back up, he's got the tigers there. Notices a little strawberry growing right on the side of the cliff. Reaches out, eats it, delicious. That's, that's the situation we are always finding ourselves in, right? We really have to maintain focus on what we came here to do and tune everything else out. You know, we have to tune it all out so we can tune it all in. And by tuning it all in, I mean your goals and dreams, your aspirations, your things that you want to create. There's so much distraction out there and, and, I, and I hope that you are tuning it out so that you can stay focused on what wants to come through you. Because like I said at the beginning of this video, there's always going to be something a crisis or a situation that is going to be wanting your attention. It doesn't matter in the world, in your personal life, whatever else. I call it dropping all the other balls and doing the one thing that is going to make the biggest impact in your life, the one thing that's going to make you feel the best as a creator, the one thing that when you do end up leaving this world and you move on to from the physical plane that you're happy with what you created, right? You're happy with what you did. You didn't leave anything on the table, right? You didn't leave anything unexpressed from within yourself. That's the goal I, I think of all of life is like to do the work we came here to do and not pay attention to all the stuff that's going on in this, this world. So I hope you're staying focused. I hope you're staying super productive. And if you want more tools like this to get you into momentum, help you do your work in the world, I want to invite you to check out Tools for Conscious Creators. That's the tool pack that I created when you sign up for my email list at gmarkphillips.com and you'll have access to those tools. These are tools that I use to get me into action, to help me overcome the fear, doubt, and anxiety. Also planning tools, right? Basically, it's tools for creators 
so that we can do our work in the world and you're a creator and the idea is that you create a binder with these these are going to be go-to tools that you can use in any given situation to help you create the things and experiences you want to have in your business and your life so i want to invite you to do that at gmarkphillips.com thank you so much for watching if you found this video helpful please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel for more videos like this helping you create the business and lifestyle that you want Thanks again. Have an awesome day. All the best. Health, wealth, and success. Bye-bye.